Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back. Here we go. Doing For some more the farming. farming. Farming part five. The farming. The farming part the five. The farming. Raj, how's your week been, man? It's been good. It's been busy. Yeah, what you been up to? I've had a... I recorded a rock and roll album. Dude, fuck yeah, you did. Hopefully I recorded all of it. Not sure, though. It's, uh... Not sure if it's done? Yeah, I know. It, yeah, yeah. I'm not sure. It's, okay. uh... It's a long process. Yeah. Truth. I think that we got everything done, but also I don't know how it sounds because I don't have anything mixed. Yeah. So that's the not hardest having, part too, yeah. Having the raw files and I haven't listened to them since I've done it. So it's kind of one of those things to where I think we got everything, but I'm still not sure and it's yeah, kind it's of uncomfortable. Because I don't know if we need to go back and redo anything. Yeah. But it was a fun process, highly stressful to try and get. I got nine songs in three days, so that's trying to record everything that we need for three songs a day, basically. Yeah, but that's crazy. Tracking drums, oh, it was a, it was a big deal. It was a nightmare. Yeah, it was. Uh, you know, I learned that I'm uh, I'm pretty good at uh, I'm pretty good at takes. I have like maximum three takes. Yeah. On everything. It was pretty good. I felt very comfortable with that. Nice. Um, I, I don't want to track drums for a while, but the uh, just because Got it, it seemed like that was that was the first day, and the first day is always the worst day because you have to set up the room, get accustomed oh, to how fuck. you're doing everything. Yeah. And it's just a. Uh, <clears throat> it just seemed I felt. So when you say track drums, what, what do you mean? We're live tracking drums while we're playing the song. Okay. And so we're playing the song to a click track, which also, by the way, the click, a lot of the songs that I've written, or we've written as a band, uh, it changes tempo. And so having one click track, when you change tempo twice in the song, yeah. is not going to be conducive. Right. So you think that... We, we didn't even think about that in terms of writing different tempos. We were yeah. just like, this is the how this should go, and it sounds yeah, really yeah, yeah, yeah. good like this. And you don't know until you're there. Um, and you don't know until you're there, and it's like, man, this changes tempo three times. Yeah. It's nuts. Like, it's actually really cool that we created something that seems very simpl simplistic, but actually is kind of complex. Yeah. Um, and trying to go to the click with that was kind of, it was all just like, I felt defeated after the first day. Second day felt really, really good with how everything was going. Um, tracked almost all my guitar parts. It was good. The bass parts almost got done. And the third day, with vocals and stuff, didn't feel as confident, and it's kind of like up in the air, listen to some of the songs back. Tried to add what we thought needed to be added, and it was just, it's its a highly stressful situation. Yeah. But I hope it's, I hope that it's done, and I hope that it sounds good, and that we like it. Um, I'm not sure if I will ever get to the point where it's like, yes, I love like this, perfect. this is excellent, this is perfect, I don't need to touch this anymore. Yeah, but I but. think that's okay. I think that, that, like, it's okay to continue to fucking learn. Well, yeah. And, like, want to, like, change things. Because it's like, here's the thing. When you want to change something about a current project, you just save that change for the next time you do a project. Yeah. You know? Like, and you can't, that... you can't, like, you're, you should never stop thinking, how can I improve this? Just wait and put it into the next thing you make. Yeah. You know. It's one of those things where the, I, feel, you, I feel much more fuck. confident about... Oh. It's a double. Yeah. It's a doble. The, uh... Yeah, I feel much more confident if we went in again that I would have everything down more so. Yeah, and you yeah. will every time you go in to do it. You yeah. know, each time... It's like with this. It's like with this stuff, you know? Like the first time we had no idea what the fuck we were doing. Now we still have no idea, but... Uh, at least I got a smash, you know? Yeah. <laughs> like, and we just... I don't know. Oh, god damn it. That was supposed, yeah, I know. Is this it? We got 13,000. Uh, no, seven. it wasn't. I gotta yeah. re-equip that Casey bat. I'm feeling good about this, though. I think that we're gonna get it. Dude, I hope so, man. Otherwise, so. otherwise, we're, uh... Oh, it's not wasted time though, because we're getting higher levels. We're you know? getting crazy experience, dude. It's good. Crazy. This is what we need, really. This is what's gonna make the game so much easier. I'll just go over. There you go. Boom. Ooh, Smack. Nice. Done. Smith bap doobity bop. Hoop blap. Uh. Oh 
Oh damn it! I was trying to. I was trying to. Oh, was him. there one there? Yeah, there was one in the middle. Oh, of, in the middle of the pile. A star oh, he's just a star me. I'm gonna try with the case. Floating oh, in the sky. He'd like to come and meet us, but he thinks he'd blow our minds. There's a star nice man yeah. waiting in the sky. <laughs> oh, David Bowie, I miss you. I miss him too. Miss you already. I keep like finding new things of his that I never knew of that I love. Yeah. Which sucks. Like that's well, the. Well, no, I think. I mean, no, it's great. It's great because you get to experience it, but it sucks that you like. I don't know. You feel this loss of not having experienced it while they were around. I think that that's know? what I was trying to articulate before during that Harvest Moon thing. Yeah. Is exactly what you just said. Yeah. About how the people were like, oh, I loved him in like Labyrinth. Have that beat the only thing. It's like, man, you're missing out on so much more awesome stuff that he's done. Yeah, there's a ton out there. Yeah. yeah it's it's great. The, uh, yo, you got a surprise opening. You're good. Yeah, we're good. The, uh, I would have. Oh yeah, you gotta get rid of the shield hat. Oh, I gotta get rid of this guy, the star man, because if he explodes... Like, yeah. if the robot explodes... Yeah, then you're, then you're done, done. Yeah, that's true. So, hopefully, you're right. the, hopefully you're I'll right. be able to take him out before you're he... You're right, there he is! Oh! He's done! Oh, well, I think he just explodes when he dies, oh, so you yeah. always take damage. But eh. That's why you gotta make sure you, you gotta, kill the other guy first. Can you life up Kaigu? Yes. I think that'd be good. Thank you for being my co-pilot on that. Yeah, I gotta equip the... Uh, the Casey. No, totally, though. I think that you're right. I think that you articulated what I was trying to say. Like, listen to... Like, what I was saying, like, listen to Young Americans, or yeah. listen to... Listen to Station to Station, and then, like, let's talk, because there's a whole world of this person that I feel like a lot of people are missing. Yeah. And not in a, like, a hoity-toity thing. It's well, more it's like a... Well, it's just that there's, like, so much stuff, and not all of it was, like, in our face... Pictures, yeah, absolutely. You know? yeah, I mean, it was for the time of the people that lived it. Yeah, but it's, it's like this huge mine that you can you can. Uh, what if we had it and then we just didn't realize it? I was thinking that. that was so <laughs> that's why so I funny. looked through our fucking. <laughs> I figured that that's why you did. I it. was like, I wonder if there's swords I figured, here. Yeah. What happens if it is that we've been uh, farming? We got it like the third I'm time, just and we've just this. been farming the entire time looking for that something that's fun. already. I think been we found. checked it before at one point too, but that's funny. All right, sounds good. Uh, all right, cool. Let's get back into the fray. Yeah, no, I. It's kind of like that's how I feel. Like I feel like uh, it's one of those things to where it's just this ever-growing kind of appreciation. Yeah. The uh, yeah, totally. And I feel like a lot of people. Well, and that's what you're supposed to do, like when somebody when when you know, like when a celebrity passes on, you like that's the time you catch up on all their shit that you missed out on. Well, and it's then it's of, like in you, the you, you, in the eye, and you want to have stuff to talk to people about too. Fuck. I feel like it's this. Oh shit. Okay. Well, that's at least than you got red. it. Yeah. It's better than red. The uh, there you go. You 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 you're golden. You're so money. He's golden. I didn't even think that you needed to uh, to switch it, dude. I always do for these guys because I just don't want him to miss, and they are not hitting. Oh, oh there you go. Okay, fuck. you're right. You're right. You're right. When you're right, you're right. When you're right, you're right. <laughs> Oh god damn it, juking me out with the levels. Larry! <laughs> Flifty Seven! Flifty! What is that? Larry, you're in Flifty Seven! Larry! Larry, Larry when did you get to Flifty Seven? seven? <laughs> wow! We're going mad being in this hallway for her for this long. <laughs> eh, these fucking robots though, I hate them. Yeah, it's it's kind of like one of those things to where I wish that I, I knew more of Alan Rickman's like uh Thing speaking of another person. Who oh yeah, away. more of Alan Rickman's. Like works. I wish that I was able to see. I I think that that's the one thing with a well, actor I think that, because he was he was he got into the movies in his like late thirties early forties right. Yeah yeah yeah. And I feel like I he, he was one that I wish I would have saw some of his theater work. You know yeah because he was an acclaimed theater like thespian absolutely. Um, and it's kind of one of those things to where he was like the opposite of the. Of his character from Gal Galaxy Quest, instead of right, being typecast yeah. into this thing, he kind of like threw himself at these huge roles. Yeah, and he would do them, knowing that he wouldn't. I don't think he ever not got typecasted, really. No, I mean not really. I mean like, but the thing is, he never got typed. He extent. never got typecast. Well, yeah, but he never got typecast. But he always like gave off that Alan Rickman fucking flair. Yeah, that vibe. You know, like every character that he did had El like him in it, but it was never like the same character. You but know? yeah, like Hans Gruber is in no way similar to Snape. His, his Snape. 
for or example, to who he was in Galaxy Quest yeah. or the robot or Marvin from, the robot, yeah. yeah. I mean, or his character in Love Actually. Dude, his character in Love Actually is completely different than all, all of those. Yeah, and so it's like, he still has the Alan Rickman kind of snark to him, you know? I think that that's what it is. It is, is that a little it's bit a of a snark. snark. It is a little um, bit of a snark. But it, they're all vastly different characters, and it's kind of one of those things. I just rewatched Galaxy Quest again. I love that movie. And uh, it, by Grapthar's hammer, I you will shall be yeah. avenged. The that's so great, and he does such a good job in it. They all do actually. Um, it's a great Sigourney cast. Weaver, it's yeah. such a good cast. Yeah, um, uh, they're all great. Tony Shalhoub. Yes, he's so, he's so good. So good. Loved the, uh, him on Wings. Dwight Schrute's in it. Is he really? Yeah, he's one of the aliens. Oh, dude, I didn't even... Oh, yeah, I remember. And the guy from uh, Just Shoot Me. Yeah. Right? Yeah, the, yeah, yeah. Uh, he's, Elliot he's, from Just uh, Shoot Me. He's or something. Yeah, yeah. Well, on that... This, on this note, yeah, it's a good place to end. That's a good place, place to end it. So we're going we're gonna to maybe do a Farming 6. We probably will, yeah, because yeah. we were going to do it until they got to... Um, 60. 60, and... Okay, we're getting close. Right. Yeah, so it might we're getting be next, close. It might, might be next. next it might uh, be two. I really kind of want to go for this sword. Yeah, because I've never seen it gotten. So I feel like we've be, invested this much time. We've into invested it. a lot of time. So hopefully you guys like it, uh, and we will see you all next time. Bye bye. Watkins, yeah, 2 million 69. Look at points. that. Fucking, that's so crazy. Look at that offense. Yeah. 249. Those guts. Man. It's not very fast, though. No. It doesn't seem like he's very smart. What's Kagu's intelligence? Kagu. Oh, that makes sense. 42. And this dude here, 56. Yeah, he's a, he's a whiz kid. 25. Oh, Larry's not, Larry's Larry's not too bright, uh, apparently. <laughs> he's, he needs some schooling.